Hi, this is Karen Greenhouse, and today we're going to show you how to use the Casio graphing calculators to show multiple representations on one screen. So the first thing you do is from the menu, go into graph, no matter which calculator you're on, so you can get there, and you're going to enter your function, first of all, and you simply, you'll notice that all calculators, the buttons are sort of in the exact same place, um, so we're just going to enter negative x squared minus 2x plus 2, a simple quadratic function, and hit execute, and now you're going to see the graph in each, depending on the calculator, it looks slightly different, um, resolution, you know, as you move up the line. So now we want to um, see a table, so to do that, while you're in graph, you're going to hit shift menu and scroll down to get to dual screen and turn it on to GT which means graph to, to table. It'll take you back to that screen and then when you hit execute or draw again what you get is a table and there's no values and so we're going to actually enter our own values. You can do that by tracing or as we're doing hit F5 G solve and let's find some key points. So we're finding the roots and you'll notice on the Casio Prism, the CG10, that when you hit execute, the points actually stay on the graph. So that's a added feature as you get into the more um, uh, functionality graph, the Prism. So we're just going to enter some key values. We're using GSOL for the first three. So we got our two roots and we've got our max point. And then we're just going to hit trace, so F1, and trace an additional point. And so now you'll see we have the function, the graph, and a table, multiple representations all on one screen.